Hello and a very warm welcome to Bharata First. You're watching FRP Explains. I'm Frank Rausen Pereira. Since you're here, please like the video, subscribe, hit the bell icon, and share the content so that more people get to know about Bharata First. Let me also inform you about our other YouTube channel, My Bharata. Uh, it has been launched with an intent to make you more aware about content related to Indian heritage, Indian culture, Indian art, and Indian history. The link of My Bharata is in the description of this particular video. You can go through it and subscribe right now to enjoy all the content that we have on there. Right, I'm here to talk about an incident that took place on Sunday in Kollam district of Kerala. Shameful to say the least when students, candidates, aspirants were going in to write their NEET examinations to get into one of the medical colleges to get a medical seat or a dental seat. Atrocious really uh, incident took, uh, took place and came to light. Uh, thankfully, uh, this particular incident came to light because the father of a 17 year old girl who had gone to write the exam made a police complaint later. What was this all about? When girls, young teens were sent in to the examination hall to write their examinations, they were sent in two different lines and in the beginning they did not understand what was happening later on they came to understand and realize the security personnel there were asking them if they had any hooks on their inner wear basically hooks on their bras in case they did they had to go in a separate line and the others who did not had to go in a separate line later on to the horror of all these young uh, uh, aspirants and candidates it came to light that they were asked to remove their bras because they had hooks and they had to take off their bras and only then were they allowed to write the examination. Their dignity was taken away from them. What an unfortunate act that took place in Kollam in Kerala. Now why did it happen? The rules or the agency that looks into the NEET examination is the National Testing Agency and they have brought out some rules and guidelines to ensure smooth functioning of these examinations without any malpractice or without any cheating place taking place. And for this, the rules and guidelines very clearly state that there shall be no shoes, there shall be no jewelry and there shall be no metallic objects. And since these bras had metallic hooks, they came under the category of metallic objects and hence the security personnel had to ask them to take off these bras and not just that the callous nature in which they did it some of them were even asked is your bra more important or is your future more important just take it off and get in and go and write the examination is what the security uh, officials there said what was worse was all these bras were bunched together and kept on a table and it was just left there so the uh, young women who had to go in to write their examinations were feeling so, uh, you know, disgusted with what had just happened. So they could not really concentrate on the examination itself. Many of them had to cover their chests with their hair. Others had to try and borrow their parents or mother's stole or whatever else that they had with them so that they could, they could uh, you know, cover themselves and then go in and write the examination. What was worse was when they were coming out of the examination hall, it is the same officials who just handed over the brass to them and said, take it and go away. So they had to sift through those bunches of brass that were there together and find their bra and they were asked to immediately leave. One of the security officials even said, don't waste our time. Just take your bra in your hand and get lost. Go away. Don't crowd around this particular place. And that was the ordeal that these young candidates and aspirants really had to go through. Now, the NTA has said that a fact finding team will look into the incident and look at the matter and decide what exactly has gone wrong and those who are guilty will be brought to book. Initially, the NTA completely denied that this ever took place and said that it was fictitious and they were informed that it was fictitious. And now, once the police has gotten involved, more parents have come forward and actually filed FIRs. Uh, they have decided to swing into action and take some action as far as this particular incident is concerned. The police too are very concerned about this particular issue, not to say the parents and students, of course. 
the team of course will go and find you do its due diligence and do whatever it has to that's different but the bigger question is what about bringing in reforms as far as the nta is concerned shouldn't we look at newer ways to try and tackle some of these issues of malpractices and cheating technology can be used why do we have to use such outdated techniques you know how much of cheating can you do with a piece of jewelry a necklace or couple of earrings or what is a bra hook really going to do as far as cheating is concerned i mean it's absurd i don't get it at all uh, and to say the least i mean if you have to strip search a candidate to maintain the dignity of the test i would say it's not the candidate that's the problem it's the test that the, that is the problem and we do away with the entire process we need to have better systems in place we need to have better technology in place to try and look at all of these aspects yes malpractice does take place yes cheating does play, take place we've seen the infamous incident of the psi recruitment scam in karnataka where highest level of police officers were involved that's a video that we did last week too many of you uh, you know had a say with regards to the psi recruitment scam as well so this is not something new it has happened and talking about the incident of the uh, removal of the bras i mean that too is not something new in kerala a similar incident took place in 2017 so it's repeating itself 5 years later too i on the whole the system those who are conducting these examinations the guidelines and the uh, rules that we have need an overhaul need a change and need a closer look we need to be a far more sensitive towards these candidates who are actually going and writing the exam because it's a big deal for them they are already under so much of stress going through so much in their minds we need to ease their burden not just pile the pressure on them i want to hear your thoughts do we need reforms as far as nta is concerned do we need reforms as far as our exams are concerned and the entrance tests that we have how do we bring about change what change would we like to see yes technology is one we need to improve better technology sensitization of the staff that is involved on the ground to help facilitate the entire process is something that we need as well and the rules and guidelines need not be this rigid that when you say in the guide book if there is a metal object doesn't mean that all metal objects should be banned for instance uh common sense needs to be used in certain places and a bra hook certainly uh, can be given some kind of a leeway and let go off so what do you think about this issue let me know in the comment section below and uh, we'll hear what you say about this incident as well and your thoughts are very important with that it's a wrap but before i go let me inform you about uh, my bharata a platform that has been launched keeping in mind indian heritage indian culture and indian history it's a youtube channel that has excellent content please subscribe to it and enjoy the content talking about content the bharat of us knowledge center has 26 courses in all to help you through your competitive exams as well as make you better bharatiyas courses start as low as 150 rupees each log in to kc.bharatofus.com or download the bharat of us app to get more details and register right now before i go don't forget to like subscribe and share so that more people get to know about bharata first that's it from me see you again next time